MP Shabana Mahmood will be at a public meeting in Newtown in Birmingham tonight called in response to a rise in violent crime. Well, the meeting, which is being held close to where a father of four was shot dead last month, comes on a day that national figures show knife and gun crime are both up by more than a quarter in the year to June. Callum Watkinson reports. Michael Sterling's murder in a drive-by shooting in Newtown last month was for some a watershed moment. The final act in a summer of violence in Birmingham that proves urgent action is needed on knife and gun crime. But to Andreus Smith, it was simply the moment he lost an old friend. Much admired, mourned and missed. Shocking, like crazy feeling, like I didn't believe it, like even until now, I still don't believe it, like someone I knew for so long, so close to, and this has happened to, so I looked at two. I don't know, it's really hard to, like, you know, put into words what's happened. People I spoke to today were divided as to whether it is worse here now than it used to be, but united in feeling that the authorities don't care and the police can't be trusted. At a public meeting tonight called in response to the rising tide of violence, that is one of the issues activists hope to address. This has been going on a long time now, particularly in this particular area of Newtown, gun crime, knife crime, people living in fear, and tonight's an opportunity for them to come out, be heard by the authorities, and let's make a plan and hatch a way forward. But it's really very clear that the young people who live around here do not trust the authorities in general, and in particular, they don't trust the police. So how do you even begin to overcome that? It's a major part of the problem. I mean, let's be fair, it just is. This is what we've got to overcome. Tonight is about those individuals, those people who have the mistrust, those people who have that feeling of disaffection, that cut off from society, to actually have their say. The police will be at the meeting tonight, but from what I heard outside the shops in Newtown today, getting people here to talk to them will be easier said than done. Callum Watkinson, ITV News, Newtown. And we did ask West Midlands Police to speak to us ahead of that meeting tonight, but they declined. A second man arrested.